All right, we are back in Oribos. So, Bolvar. I will aid you as best I can. What news from Maldraxxus, sneaks Uzad? He listens to your tales. So, yeah, let me tell you about what happened during my time there. It would seem you must brave the horrors of the Maw once again. I know not how to locate this missing Maldraxxi Baron, nor our living allies. But I believe I can help you find Dari and Bograin. That's a start, at least. Yep, that's a start. I could certainly Honor use Darien back. We seek entrance to the Maw. There is but one path to that dark realm. The same route all souls destined for damnation must take. But be warned, mortal. Though you escaped the Maw once, you may not be so fortunate a second time. I'll take my chances. What news? Take this amulet. One like it is carried by each of the four horsemen. The amulets are imbued with a power that links them to one another. That connection should help you locate Darien Mograin. No doubt Darien has witnessed countless horrors in the Maw. Perhaps he has caught sight of the missing Baron. Let us hope he can lead you to our Azerothian allies as well. We all have our burdens to bear. Jump into the soul pillar from the Ring of Transference. Okay. is quiet. There's no sign of your allies. Charging Bolvar's amulet. Kill Maw Swarm within the cauldron to siphon their essence. The amulet Bolvar gave you flickers with a faint red light, then grows dim. To be useful in finding Dairy and Mograin, you must find a way to restore its potency. You recall an area called Zoval's Cauldron that was teeming with dark magic. Perhaps the amulet's power could be restored there. Ah. That is for later. Oh, that's right, I can't mount up here. That's how we get back to Oribos. Join me, my minions. They don't charge it. It's gotta be in this area. Why 
be a little bit of a struggle considering that there are Alliance players kind of taking away credit for this from me. Maybe, but just because he's true doesn't mean he's right. Hmm, I don't think we're supposed to fight that guy just yet. It's too far. is almost done. Too far. I don't have a target. I need to get closer. The amulet burns hot in your hand. The magic that runs through it tugs slightly at your grip. Perhaps the enchantment spoken of by Bolvar can now be used to find Mograine. Where are you, Darian? Darian! He's unconscious. The cage is locked and doesn't appear easily broken. Perhaps the holder of the key is this brand he mentioned. I see stairs. I like how there's this in between the first two zones. We're not going straight to Ardenweald after this. We have an in between here to kind of, you know come back to the Maw to try and find someone to help out with this other zone before we even, like, Ardenweald does not even come up yet. Like, we are here for a story reason. I like that. Army of the Dead! All 
there's a behemoth down here. Ah! Okay, hold on. I'm gonna need a bite to eat here in just a moment once I'm out of combat. I'm still in combat. Still in combat. Still in combat. My thanks, champion. Now that I am free, I should soon regain my strength. How long have I been trapped in the maw? A day? An eternity? Careful. The jailer's eyes are everywhere. Yeah, well, hold on a second, dude. Never escape the maw! Oh my gosh. I guess we're fine. Broker. Oh, this broker helped us. I didn't even see that. Oh, wait. Death Essence is what's saying this? I was curious what the Mossworn were searching for. You are that mortal who swept through and thwarted the Jailer's festivities. I am Venari, a humble broker trapped in this land of torment. I have a proposition for you. Come. Why would you aid us, broker? Your presence here draws attention. The sort of attention that's bad for my business dealings. And no offense, of course. Alright, hold on a second. <laughs> Kinda messed up my uh, eating there, trying to get that food bonus. also get my minions back up all mysteries will be revealed oh that sounds like the actress who plays Anna in Overwatch are you willing to listen to my proposition my my today certainly has been full of surprises now mortal I'm curious what has brought you back to the mall so mortal you are here looking for someone well it just so happens that clever as I am it's quite possible I know where they are. Allow me to propose a trade. That amulet you carry, it holds an interesting power. You give me the amulet, and I will help you find this Maldraxi Baron. And then you will leave. I don't mean to be rude, but I really prefer to keep a low profile. Allow me to speed things along. Procure. I have picked up a few tricks to help me survive here. The Jailer will take notice if you engage his forces, so it is wise to go around them whenever possible. I have limitless time. You do not. Keep up. We have little time. It's quite a thrill to have a mortal for a business partner. The amulet really is intriguing. What's that? Oh yes, that baron you're searching for. Well, it so happens that I learned of a Maldraxi warlord being held in the lower courtyard of Perdition Hold. As you might guess by the name, it's not the most charming of places. I would prefer to avoid the attention of the Jailer's forces. Fortunately, I have just the thing. Give the word, and I will conceal us from the Mossworn. I, will I can conceal us long enough to find your wayward baron. Come along. I'm convinced that is the same voice actress who plays Anna in Overwatch. Do not Stay close. I do not wish to draw attention with a fight. How long have you been trapped here? 
Longer than you have, mortal. That is all you need to know. Indeed. I just love that Darian is still using two of the sword from a. Uh, Wait for the beast from to From the pass. South Park episode about World of Warcraft. The Morsworn are certainly eager to find you. We need to make this quick. Do not rush us, Broker. There are others who must be saved. Along with the Maldraxxi Baron. Ah, you speak of the mortals left behind when your friend here escaped. I fear they've been taken to Torghast. That tower, looming in the distance. The Jailer keeps his most prized possessions within. Torghast. Show us the way to breach that tower. It would wow, those things killed me fast. Now. Remain focused. There will be time for... She kept the moving, and there was like no point where they ever was like, you know... <laughs> I trust you and not they kill. We're going to help me I fight don't them wish off. To draw attention with a fight. How long have you been trapped here? Longer than you have, mortal. That is all you need to know. Like she's seriously having us just walk straight into them. But I'm gonna make sure my minions are out. This is why also another reason why I hesitate playing unholy, because the ghoul can sometimes mess things up. By the way, I'm apparently an honorless target. Hold. Wait for the beast to pass. Why am I not hidden anymore? The Morsworn are certainly eager to find you. We need to make this quick. There we go. Do not rush us, Broker. There are others who must be saved, along with the Maldraxxi Baron. Ah, you speak of the mortals left behind when your friend here escaped. I fear they've been taken to Torghast. That tower, looming in the distance. The Jailer keeps his most prized possessions within. Then show us a way to breach that tower. It would be folly to go after them now. Remain focused. There will be time for theatrics later. You're not doing a very good job of keeping that shroud on me. This must be your missing Baron. Who is there? Must... The Alexandros Mograin? I know that voice. Can it be? The Baron is... my father? Darian... after all this time... Much respect to the Ashbringer. THE Ashbringer. Alexandros Mograin. All is not lost. Not yet. My father, Alexandros Mograin, the Ashbringer. I never expected to see him again. Since crossing into the Shadowlands, I've been so focused on our mission that I never even considered the souls of my family being here somewhere. Whatever this realm called Maldraxxus is, I hope it is worthy of my father's service. If he's a warlord in Maldraxxus, yeah, I'm pretty sure he has a, yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, that says something about what Mograin here has been able to uh, accomplish during his time here. Be being able to earn the title of a baron or a warlord in a place like Maldraxxus. That says something about what Alexandros Mograin has been able to do here. We must free him. There is much I need to say to him. The Knights of the Elden Blade will not alter.
Did you think your presence would go unnoticed? You will not leave this place. Trapped. <sighs> well, go on then. Show us that wanted might, mortal. Thank you enough. It feels as if the Maw itself is sentient and taking notice of our presence. We must leave at once. Bolvar must be informed of what is happening here. I will bring my father with us. Lead the way out of here, with haste. I suggest a tactical retreat. I will take us to a small alcove near the Waystone that enabled your previous exodus. Son. Save your strength, Father. We will have time to speak later. Wait. My sword. Fatebringer. I will have need of it. What? Fatebringer? It's like, it looks like another version of the Ashbringer. That looked awesome. Look at that thing. I believe this con That looks like a version of the corrupted Ashbringer. The Waystone is just up that way. Thank you very much, Vanari. Find anything of interest, Moorwalker. Now to get you and your associates out of here. Discover more secrets. Then we can talk. I believe now is the time for you to leave. You are a Maw Walker, one who can activate the Waystone between the Maw and the lands beyond. While your friends may not hold the same title, there is a way to send them through the gate. Souls can be connected. In theory, if you let someone attune themselves to the, your soul while you activate the Waystone, you both should be able to leave, even when fleeting connections may produce some result. Go with your other two guests and see if my hypothesis is correct. With that farewell, please do not tell anyone you saw me. And if you find yourself leaping into this maelstrom of gloom again, I do hope you'll bring along something interesting to trade. I'll see what I can do, Venari. In the meantime, we gotta go. I love that he still has the title of the Ashbringer, because of course he does. His armor looks awesome. And that is an awesome, uh... I'm curious how it works, since the Ashbringer was literally made by, you know, as part of a, uh, a Naru. Well, a Naru was made, or used, to make the Ashbringer. So I'm curious what was used to make that sword, the Fatebringer. And is it just as powerful as the Ashbringer was? Now, I imagine some of you might be wondering. You return, and with others this time. That's astounding. No souls ever returned once, let alone twice with allies. A Maw Walker indeed. Some of you may be wondering, why did Alexandros apparently go to Maldraxxus instead of, say, 
Bastion. Well, I have a feeling that they might explain that later. Because it almost seems like you would think Mograine would have gone to Bastion, but then again, considering how much they were trying to basically wipe the memory of uh, your past life in Bastion, I imagine Alexandros was like, I'm sorry, what? Wipe the memory of my family? No. Uh-uh. I ain't doing that. Plus, this guy was amazing when it came to fighting. You know, and what he did with the Ashbringer against the undead. You know? <laughs> so it's it's kind of ironic, but also makes sense that he would be in a place like Maldraxxus. Just wait till Bolvar hears about this. My Lord Four Dragon, we have escaped the Maw. Thank you for your aid. Draka. So she made her way over here. We all have a duty to fulfill. You return in one piece, and with not just Darien, but his father as well. You continue to succeed, Maw Walker. I'd prefer if you just kept calling me Death Lord. Thanks. Fight Draka. for Azeroth. We must return to Maldraxxus at once. Margrave Crexus is... Our Margrave has been slain, Ashbringer. The Chosen need your blade, now more than ever. No. Then my warning comes too late. We have been betrayed by one of our own. It was Virez who had me trapped within the Maw. There can be no doubt that it was his hand that struck down our Margrave. I knew something was up with Viraz. He seemed way too eager to send soldiers out to die. Blood and thunder. Viraz, all this time. This cannot stand. We must avenge Crexus and cut him down. He must have sent you to the Maw expecting that you would never return. He underestimated you. A fatal mistake. Go with Mograine and claim Viraz's head. I will warn our forces at the seat of the Primus. Meet Alexandros Mograine at the House of the Chosen in Maldraxxus. We depart from Maldraxxus at once. Viraz will answer for his crimes. I must return to Azeroth and tell our allies what we've learned, Father. But when duty allows it, I will stand once more at your side. There will be time for us to speak later, my son. I swear it. By the way, notice Alexandros Mograine is yellow instead of green. I find that interesting. Yep, that's an upgrade. <laughs> no, no, no. I'll be changing that in just a moment. Literally. I have many, many wares. Munchies, crunchies, lucky doos and root. I'm sorry, I love that helm way too much. Okay. To the flight master. And then we will head back to Maldraxxus. Greetings, mortal. And by the way, of course there was betrayal. Remember what I said about how I expected Maldraxxus might have some of a political backdrop and kind of a Game of Thrones-esque type of feel? So of course there was a betrayal within our own house. 
I mean, doesn't that just sound familiar? He's already back up. The three we fought were that guy, her, and that guy. That guy hurt so much. Why did it send me all the way back over here? Ah, uh, oh well. Well, hey, at least this doorway over here is open. Actually, this gives me an opportunity to go grab a Flight Master that I did not get before. This one right over here. I realize I never actually went over and grabbed this. We actually haven't even gone over here to look at what remains of the House of Eyes. So we gotta swing by there on this road in order to get to the Flight Master, so maybe we'll take a glance at what remains. Ew. So this is what remains of the House of Eyes. Right over here. There it is. Here to sate your curiosity. Huh. I wonder where the world boss or bosses are. And I wonder if I'm actually going to be able to actually see them. Because it looks like two of them might be here in this zone. Maybe they don't show up unless you hit level 60? Maybe they're not part of that phase? Or lair? I mean, that would kind of make sense. We don't want to be encountering a world boss by accident while leveling, right? That'd be kind of unfortunate. Oops! I'm considering switching back to blood for the upcoming fight. I'm anticipating it's going to be a tough fight. So I may want to go back to uh, blood to deal with it. So. This land festers. We must cauterize the wound. I cannot allow this wound to fester any longer. I will burn it closed here and now. Viraz is the one who trapped me within the Maw. He has long been in league with the House of Rituals and the House of Constructs. No doubt he intended to trap you within that hellish place as well. It is time he be brought to justice for his treason. Stand with me, and we will face him as one. Hmm. It says it's actually an upgrade for me. But at the same time, I'm kind of considering wanting to collect one-handed swords. Anyways. Trample our enemies. Leave nothing. Virus! The relentless Show yourself! pursuit of victory. The final rune.
So the mortal returns, along with our wayward Baron. The constructs failed to finish you, and so did the Maw. How disappointing. Your schemes have brought about your own ruin. Now we will end you! Foolish Mograine. Always valuing loyalty over might. But victory lies in one's choice of allies. And with their help, I now claim the mantle of Margrave. I will bury my blade in your skull, traitor! For Crixus! For Crexus. I bested Crexus himself! You two are nothing. You can we will avenge him! Here and now! Fool. Enough games! Gods! Slaughter these weaklings! Honorless coward! Ashbringer, Moorwalker, with me! The seat of the Primus is under siege. We must defend it! Aww. I was hoping we were gonna finally kill that guy. Oh well, maybe what's ever in the seat of the Primus, now that I have the fifth rune, can actually help us get the uh, edge over him. Oh, they are actually here at the door. Then how will be done? Look, God. We're struggling to hold the line. We need to act fast. Ugh. Oh, wait. Where are my minions? Yeah, flesh craft for a DPS is not that great because it's dependent on maximum health, which Unholy doesn't have compared to blood. How goes the fight? You empowered the final rune? Then we might yet turn the tide of battle. Open the door. We'll hold the enemy back as long as we can. Strength, we'll hold the line. Open the door. Oh, back here. Unlock the door. Slay the mortal! Bring me that rune blade! Raise your sword, Captain! Form out Rexus! The foes of the worthy shall be vanquished Hold back! That's right, run, Viraz. The feet of the Primus is ours! All right, Primus, let's hope he didn't let us down. Let's hope that whatever is in here. Was worth it. Hmm. 
The rune blade glows brighter as you approach an old stone altar. I am the Primus. Your presence within my sanctum means a darkness has fallen upon Maldraxxus and all the realms of death. Ages ago, the Eternal Ones punished our brother Zoval for his treachery. He was bound within the inescapable maw to be forevermore its jailer. Now I fear that Zoval did not act alone. I suspect he had ancient allies and will seek to win others to his cause. That you are hearing this message means my suspicions prove true. Zoval has forged his chains into a weapon and brought about my defeat. There is but one hope to save the Shadowlands. The Eternal Ones must stand together once more, before the Jailer escapes the Maw. Bring my warning to the Archon, the Winter Queen, and the Sire. They must see to our defenses. Do not let Zoval reach the Sepulchre. The Arbiter is the final key. Protect her, or all is lost. That is some message. The Blade of the Primus. We finished the main storyline here in Maldraxxus. The Eternal Ones. I'm very interested in knowing about them. So, the Jailer used to be known as Zolval. And apparently he was up to some treachery. Which is why he was imprisoned in the Maw. Always ready for battle. Even in his absence, the wisdom of the Primus rings true. This message must have been put here to await one of one who proved worthy of hearing it. You came to Maldraxxus to learn why Bastion was invaded. Now you know that there is treachery in our ranks, and that there are noble souls here who will set things right. Tell your allies in Oribos all that you have witnessed. See that the warning of the Primus reaches the Eternal Ones. It would be an honor to fight by your side again. Are the Eternal Ones the ones we've been interacting with in Oribos? Is that who those are? I'm pr I, I guess that's really what, what uh, we're getting at here. For breakfast! The Eternal Ones. The Jailer. This is a dire message. Return to Oribos. Inform them that Maldraxxus will not strike at the other realms again. Our war lies within. Well, now we have our task that the Primus just said, which is he wants us to go inform all the leaders. He wants us to go tell the Archon, the Winter Queen, and the Sire. So that right there gives us our reason and cause. Oh, there is actually more in here. This is just the only portion. Apparently there's rooms on the side and such. I wonder what is in here. What's this area over here? I also wonder if this is stuff that's going to be closed off. Unless I choose to uh, side with this covenant, which of course I am. I've already made that clear. That this character is joining this covenant. Is 
Is there anything up here worth noting? Or is it gonna be here later? There is stuff here. And yet it feels vacant. Like, it's going to be here later, just not yet. Hmm. Yeah, this is definitely, uh, come back later and you'll find st more stuff here. All right. When we return, we will be heading back to Oribos. Stay tuned.